the shocking truth about Gaspard Yulio's skiing accident. Many artists from the entertainment and media industry made a big name within a short period and have always entertained us. Likewise, many young actors can create a name for themselves in one of the most popular industries in the world in a short time and can make a space for themselves in our hearts. But do you know what the saddest part of all is? Yeah, you would think, what is there to feel sad about, right? Some of those talented prodigies of the industry had go through some of the very difficult and problematic periods of their lives. Not only that, many such prodigies are even now undergoing some really difficult phases of their lives. They say when you are happy for one reason, life surrounds you with problems and sadness for some reasons. Humans cannot remain happy forever and thus there is always a kind of obstacles even in times of happiness. Many young actors this year and the previous year have left us without a goodbye. And some even had a very tragic and saddening goodbye that tears our heart apart. We cannot describe how upsetting and saddening it is to see some of your favorite actors leaving the industries and their lives, and that is exactly what we will be talking about today. In today's video, we will be talking about one such actor who might have given us some of the greatest memories through his acting career but recently passed away due to an accident, the shocking truth that has been unfilled about Gaspard Yulio's skiing accident. But before we begin, do not forget to like the video and subscribe to our channel. The 37 years old Gaspard Yulil passed away recently after a tragic accident leaving millions of his fans in tears and a massive heartbreak. Nobody could have ever imagined that the French uprising superstar would suddenly leave the world with his untimely death. His unnatural death was because of a skiing accident in the Alps, which led him to getting injured in the skull and losing consciousness then and there. Reports suggest that the accident was a major one and no one could survive such an impact like this. Yuliel was skiing and enjoying the snowy environment when he met with an accident at the crossing point. As you know, snow can be slippery at times, and while skiing especially, people need to stay alert and balance their bodies not to fall over. Yuliel could not maintain his body balance and collided with another skier while getting a direct hit in the skull and causing head trauma. The other skiers report aren't released to the public yet, but sources reveal that they were not hospitalized. And that is the most shocking part of the whole accident. Think about it. Why wasn't the other skier taken to the hospital? Is it because they were not hurt at all? Of course. But how is it possible? Crossings are dangerous. And if Yuliel was injured that badly to lose his life, then why did not the other skier get injured as well? Another shocking truth that has been revealed to the public is that when Yuliel got in the accident, he was still alive. He might be unconscious, but was still alive. But then, he was airlifted and taken to Grenoble University and Hospital, where even before admitting, he was declared dead. Shocking and mysterious, isn't it? The reason behind the budding actor's untimely death is seriously very tragic and fans were very hurt and sad to realize that they will never see Gaspard on the TV or in real life ever. Julius and other industrial artists shared their feelings over his sudden death and consoled his family. The Dolan twins paid their tribute through Instagram and stated how difficult it was to accept that the one persons who made them what they are and shared a journey is not there anymore. They also stated that it was really painful to accept Julius' untimely death and that they will forever love him. Although Gaspar Julius' career was not that smooth, he started from television's work like Brotherhood of the Wolf and a few more and slowly and steadily rose in his career. He starred in Jean-Pierre Junet's A Very Long Engagement, where he played the romantic lead opposite Audrey Toto. He was finally known to the world and acclaimed as Caesar for the most promising actor. Since then, he never looked back. In Hannibal Rising, he played the young Hannibal and won another Caesar for Xavier Dolans. It's only the end of the world. He is also the face of Blue de Chanel and would have been next seen as a lead character in the Marvel show Moon Knight. So that was all for today. What do you think about it? Do you think it was an accident? Why do you think the other skier were safe? And what about the hospital? Why didn't they admit him? Do share your opinions with us. Also subscribe to our channel and we will see you in the next one.